Mae survival o ataliad y galon y tu allan i'r ysbydu yn isel iawn. Felly mae clywed am nyrs a potau yn achub bywyd rhywun yn arbennig iawn. Daeth cymydog draw a nocor ar y drws a gofyn i fi synnu y mynd draw bod eifion wedi cwmpor y llawr. I could see that he wasn't breathing properly, so I turned him on his back. Um, I checked him for his pulse and he didn't have a pulse. A dechreion i wneud CPA a wedyn y gofynnus i Richard a ddim oedd y defibrillator oedd lawr y bwys o festri a wedyn beth digwyddodd fe rhedodd y carwyn partner Richard lawr un ôl y defibrillator a dyn ôl a iwson i'r defibrillator a oedd hwnnw'n gweithio ni beth i wneud a oedd hwnnw'n help yn un ffordd. By the time the ambulance crew arrived, he was in normal rhythm and was breathing for himself. Right. Uh, got some Mr. Hagel, Rachel, and... Come here. 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 Uh, felt a bit out of my comfort zone because obviously with an intensive care I've got all my monitors and my equipment that I need um, but I think you just you just go into a zone where you need to save somebody's life and that's what I was doing and that's what Aravon was doing with me. Here the defibrillator at Dordogne sign credit with the avion and the sefyllfa mai a heddi. My CPR and skill achib bywyd ac mae'n gallu wneud y gwahaniaeth rhwng bywyd a marfoliaeth fel yr oedd i Aivion. <laughs>